Jess, don't forget your phone. Thought you were going to the cinema with Joe. Whatever. It'll start with half an hour of adverts, which everyone sits through like obedient disciples of the capitalist dictatorship. What the hell are you even doing? I'm making hummus. Making hummus, he says, like it's perfectly natural. No one makes hummus. It's only hummus, Jeremy. What are you going to do next? Start making your own pasta? As a matter of fact, I have made my own pasta. Jesus, Mark. Jamie Oliver and Sainsbury's make the food. We eat the food. April from Darty's coming over, as it happens. The girl from the shoe shop. You finally tracked her down and you're luring her back to your lair to eat her with pasta. It isn't a lair, it's my flat. And, and my sole subterfuge is that she thinks she's coming to a dinner party. But I've got a feeling that the other guests may cancel at the last minute. <laughs> Naughty, unreliable guests. Finally, I'm rubbing off on you. Chez, I think she might actually be my perfect woman. She's a serious academic historian who got my joke about Indiana Jones. She just texted saying, Professor Jones has her whip ready. I think it's probably the sexiest text anyone has ever received. Wow. You should go the full indie. I love you on the eyelids. <laughs> Brilliant. But far too mad. Go on, it'll be hilarious. I was thinking, how can I turn up the heat? I, I could blink at her as she came through the door. More than hilarious. It'll be a hoot. <laughs> it would be a bit of a hoot, wouldn't it? But it's, it's the sort of thing you'd think about but never actually do. Not on my watch. Come on, you've tracked down the love of your life. Go for it. <laughs> no, Jez. Yes, Mark. This is what real friends are for. Making you do brilliant things that you would never do otherwise. This is how the old do brothers roll. God. <laughs> right then, hold still. Come on, Mark. Oh, this is crazy. You're mental. <laughs> how does it look? <laughs>